G'day Hope Culture, good to have you signing in here on our Hope Culture channel and yeah. we got some answers for you from the Got Questions box and today, or this evening, here in the Christ Room of the Church. Okay, how do you know if you're a Christian or not? So Brinnigan, okay, enlighten us. Alright, first one, are you trusting in Jesus or not? So are you trusting that, that Jesus, as the Son of God, um, died and rose again to pay for your sin? Mm -hmm. And that is the only way, that by trusting in Him, you can, you can go to heaven. Mm -hmm. um, there is no room to trust in anything else, uh, regardless of how, how mm -hmm. like, religious or, or even Christian they may seem. Mm -hmm. So if you're kind of trusting in whether you've obeyed God enough, um, or, or whether you've been baptised, or whether you grew up in church, or your parents go to church, or anything like that. None of those things mm -hmm. will save you. Um, mm -hmm. only, only faith in Christ. So number one, make sure you're yeah. trusting in Jesus alone. Definitely. Okay, cool. Number two, I add to that, is um, have you actually committed your life to following Jesus for real? Mm -hmm. So no looking back, no holding back, absolutely everything is thrown into following Him. So modeling your life around who He is and what He taught, mm -hmm. um, doing everything that you can to obey Him and to honor Him and to get to know Him more. Mm -hmm. So have you committed your life in that sort of full-on way to following Him? If you have not yet done that, then you're not yet a Christian. Mm -hmm. Okay, real good. Number three, mm -hmm. can you, when you look at your own life, see some change? And what I'm talking about is twofold. One, you don't like sin anymore. You have a distaste for mm -hmm. sin. Mm -hmm. um, you're turning away from the sinful things mm -hmm. that you're aware of. Mm -hmm. And Hang on a second. So, just like cats hate water, what? a Christian... Yeah, cats do hate water. Bryn doesn't know this. Cats hate water? Yeah, cats hate water. A Christian will hate sin. Hate he sin. won't have. He won't want anything to do with sin. Okay, so there you go. Uh, yeah, wow. Profound. <laughs> um, no, but def definitely true. Um, as a, a Christian, cannot just be okay with sin in their life. Yeah. They will hate it. Yeah. Not only will they hate sin, but they will want to be growing in Christ likeness more. So walking in ways that please God. Yeah, for sure. And then the last one that we want to make mention of it, number four. Um, are you noticing that you are actually um, getting to know God and ex experience God? So in the, in the book of Romans chapter 8, it talks about how those of us who belong to God, who are truly Christians, have been filled by God's Holy Spirit. And that Holy Spirit that now lives inside of us and bears witness to us. In other words, it, it makes known to us that we are truly children of God. Mm. Because the Spirit of God enables us to now, in a loving way, relate to God and call out to Him as our own Father. Mm. So that's a really important thing. Um, 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 element to the answer to this question as well to think about okay am I now able to relate to God as my loving Heavenly Father mm. um, if you if that's not yet part of your experience then it could well be that you're not yet a Christian mm. okay so trusting in Christ yep committing your life to following him absolutely hating sin growing in Christ likeness yep and are you? <laughs> how, how, do, how do we summarize that? Number four, um, are you? Do you know God. Yeah, are you? Are you um, noticing that you're starting to know God and actually yes. love God and relate to Him as your heavenly Father? Cool. So think about it for yourself. Yeah. Really Don't just cool. presume you're a Christian mm -hmm. because you've come to youth or your parents were Christians or something. For sure. Mm. See you, Hope Culture. Keep shooting those questions. See ya. <laughs> How do you know if you're, if you are a Christian or not? How do you know? <laughs> well, they, they, they threw me off. They threw me off. <laughs>